first to use when you go on your knees and pray. I can say that poetry is the ultimate form of beauty, and it's your personal duty to keep contributing. I can tell you what the writers will. I can tell you that when you write, you will feel fulfilled. I can tell you all these truths in the cliche piece of generalization, but that's not the point of what I'm saying. I'm trying to lead you to emancipation. I was a hexagonal peg shoved into a square hole, molded into society's quintessence of a well-rounded individual. Individualism. A kaleidoscope of eclectic colors and notes and words that scream waje, undefined. Me. My writing is not an act of community service. I write not for people, but for persons. To show them that being an individual means being indivisible, not invisible. And if the only way I can do that is by being lyrical, I'll speak until my life's end. I'll spend every waking moment building a momentum until it's large enough to overcome the inertia of your stagnant heart. I do not come in soul and silence, peace. I come in loud, eloquent, elegant voice. I'm not here to calm the chaos. I'm here to make more noise. They say the pen is massier than the sword. They say the sword needs strength, but I say the tongue needs more. You can do more than just cathartically write. You can use your words to fight because I know that in your mind there's a war. I know you say little because you believe that less is more, yet you're full to the brim. And no one knows what goes on behind closed doors. It's not just about creating mellifluous melodies that appeal to people and force them to fall into a drunken stupor, stoned of the images that my words present. It's about making a difference. Allowing the darkness, the anger and the rage inside of you to combust and transform and go forth as light to others. Remember, every second, every minute, every hour, words are not your weakness, words are power. Power to build a people or tear a nation apart. Power to give an empty woodman a heart. Power to create magnificent art. Power to write lyrics the masses will devour. The power to lead, the power to empower. So I stand, but it's not enough to stand, so I'll run. But it's not enough to run, so I'll fly. And if you wake and you feel inadequate, I want you to tell a different story. Look into the mirror and tell yourself you're sorry for what you accidentally started to believe. So I uncross my arms and I uncross my legs and I uncross all the tiny fragments of myself which were crossed out by society's vision for me. To the one who accidentally started to believe that her words were not adequate means to achieve her dream. So to her, the one who the hackney path that was my structured future, the one who set to chase my dreams, the one who lit a match and threw it into the dying embers of my almost forgotten passion. I'll keep cutting. I'll write to fight, to turn my words into light, to live and let live, to lose and let lose. I've got one piece of advice, and with two words I'll end. Chase them. Because when it all boils down, there's no one worth fighting more for than you. Hashtag self-love.